the Budweiser's back. So today, there are many different kinds of pipes. The packs, where you use actual plant material, and you can load it from the bottom. The cloud, many of these are for oils. This is a pipe that was carved by my great-grandfather. Thought I'd show you that. Hi, as much as I like to vape, um, I don't really like to dab. I want to show you a couple of things. Um, this is butane. You can get your shatter with the same kind of butane. You fill this pipe with butane. For dabbing, you can fire these babies up like this, and then you have to heat this nail that comes out. You blast this with that to show this. Very, get that going. Then, when that's red hot, you put this little cap back on. You take your hash or your shatter and you dab that on and it fires up. Now I think this is a real hassle. You can still what I'm recommending. You take a tiny ball of hash which I've showed you before and you put it in these little pens and you can go anywhere. Taste is great. Put it in your pocket. You're gone. Ciao. So I wanted to show you a couple of things about these pens. There's a tendency for people to overload these. Um, in this case, I'm going to be using water hash, or in this one is a rosin. But you want to use a very small amount because you don't want to continue to heat and reheat and burn it. So you're using literally a tiny ball like that, and then you can put it in. Now, this is a new pipe that I've gotten. It's called the Kind Pen, and, and I happen to like this and you can put your finger on it, just rest it lightly and you see the smoke coming out and wonderful, very easy. Now this would also work with a Grenko Science. I want to alert you to the amounts. You want very small amounts to go in there and, and five or six hits should really exhaust the, that, that small would exhaust the hash and then you don't have to clean the pipe. Now, uh, periodically, once a week or so, you can put um, 191 proof alcohol in a, like a shot glass like this, and you can clean these things. You can take these apart and put those into the alcohol for cleaning, and they send these little tools with you. And this is a little silicon, which is a great uh, container for your hash and your waxes and so on. Just wanted to share that with you.